Moving from London to Glastonbury in 2020 was a coming home. Coming home to myself, my purpose, my mission, my soul's calling and true connection to God and spirit. What I'd been searching for my entire life not only became real and tangible, but it is beyond anything I could have ever imagined. There are certain places on earth that will carry a strong resonance for your soul and spiritual evolution, whether it's because of a past life connection to that land, ancestry, or simply the energy of a sacred place which unlocks your full potential and purpose. Glastonbury, or I should really say Avalon, the other world realm of Arthurian legend, the place of Excalibur, Knights of the Round Table, Holy Grail, Merlin, Lady of the Lake, has been such a place for me. And the first few days of connecting to this land and sacred sites around Glastonbury, all I could do was weep. As I walked around the tour, or sat in the apple orchard, praying by the sacred waters at Chalice Wells or the White Spring, I cried and cried and cried. Tears of joy, tears of remembrance and tears of longing, as my heart began to crack open, ever expanding through the healing magic and love from spirit and the land, and the welcoming and acceptance from the Fae, Avalon's etheric guardians. By seeking connection with the land and its beings, I have found new unity within myself. With each new initiation, medicine journey, meditation, and grail quest, I was always guided closer and closer to where I am now. And the grail quest is of course never over, and I'm truly just beginning. It was because of the sacred isle that I finally understood how I can be of service to the land. This is part of my role as a Nawenith. Awen is a flowing spirit, the muse of inspiration brought forth from Keridwen's cauldron of life, the dragon womb of creation. To drink from the Awen, the spirit of God, gives one prophetic insight, the gift of oracle, as well as creative inspiration. So to be an Awenith or Awenithian are those that take their inspiration from the source of life, from the river of the Awen, to create music and art, but also to receive prophecy and share wisdom. As the Awenith of Avalon, I walk between the worlds to speak and sing of spiritual realms, the other world and its inhabitants. The music I am creating in complete dedication to Avalon and Spirit will carry the resonance of my personal journey with the Sacred Isle and also part the mists for those who feel called to seek across the waters and discover their highest destiny.